Our drive was on a closed course at Texas Motor Speedway, with seed time divided into two segments, lapping the oval in the 3,500 crew cab dually, and a two-lap sprint through a short autocross circuit, in the crew cab ZE71 2500 model. In both instances, the single, undeniable first impression was the distinct lack of noise produced by the revised Duramax. The previous engine, while not necessarily louder than its competitors, exhibited an instantly identifiable diesel clatter that was of a higher pitched, more brittle nature than that of the Cummins and the Power Stroke. While key noise abatement features include sound dampening rocker covers in a full length, two-piece stamped aluminum slash steel oil panning front cover, it s likely that the fresh internals also contribute to the diminished clatter. Nearly every internal component has been modified or upgraded in a quest for greater refinement and power, save for the 90-degree layout of the V8, the 103.0mm bore, the 99.0mm stroke, and the basic architecture of the valve drain and its associated gear drive. The new side of the parts ledger includes the crankshaft, cylinder heads, pistons, wrist pins, connecting rods, electronically controlled turbocharger and actuator, oil cooler, fuel system, in-house developed electronic controls, glow plugs, exhaust gas recirculation valve, and the exhaust system. More than just a parts swap, the re-engineering was a comprehensive